Hi guys, you are watching Oxy Vlogs. If this is your first time here and you would like to know more information about life in Dubai, how to get a job in this city, don't forget to hit subscribe button and the bell icon so you will get a notification when I post my next video. We all know that Dubai is an attractive place for international job seekers because it offers tax-free salary, competitive packages and Dubai is located between Asia and Europe so it's a great place to live and travel around the world. Uh, but at the same time there are some fake job offers on the market you should be aware of and especially when you are desperately looking for a job it's so easy to get into these scams. So today in this video I will let you know how to identify a job scam. Just imagine a situation you got a job offer with your dream salary uh, with lots of benefits and uh, the employer wants you to join immediately but in order to have an interview you need to pay a huge non-refundable amount of money in the initial stage of the hiring process so just think about it why the employer will ask you to pay money to get a job for you now let's go through some particular situations First example is when job has been created for you. Imagine you received an email saying that you are a perfect match for a job, but you never applied for that job and they want you to sign the contract as soon as possible. I think it's very clear that it's a scam and you should definitely avoid it. Next situation, when you received a great job offer with your dream salary, competitive benefits, but you even didn't have any face-to-face uh, -face interview, they don't require any minimum qualification or work experience. It doesn't seem real at all, so you should ignore these offers. Here is another example. Uh, when the salary offered for the advertised job is too high than what is offered in the industry and there are no special or extra requirements in the job description, uh, most probably it's a scam and I don't advise you to apply for such kind of jobs. Guys, I think some of you have faced a situation when you were asked to pay money to the recruiter for getting a job for you in the form of a processing fee or registration fee and they ask you to uh, transfer money urgently in their personal account. Any such recruiter should be a red flag for you. Never transfer money in a personal account. So guys, when you are not sure if this is a scam or not, let me tell you how you can prevent fake job offers. Avoid sending your CV to unauthentic recruiters on email. Uh, you may receive several emails per day that advertise jobs, even if you haven't registered to such websites. When you see uh, emails that don't involve any financial transactions, you feel harmless to share your CV with a third party. But the truth is that when you share your CV with a fake recruiter, you share your contact information with them and they use it to build their database for their fake activities. When you're looking for a job, you should do some research on the market and look for reliable sources only. Most of the employers prefer to uh, list their job openings on their own website or with a reputed online job portal or a recruitment agency. If you receive a job invitation from an unknown um, company, I re highly recommend you to do some research. Uh, it's very easy to do, you just need to google their name and see if they have any website, try to find their contact details and call them directly. Another very important point is to check the email ID of the sender. If they have personal email ID, for example gmail.com or yahoo.com, not a corporate domain, most probably it's a scam. As I said earlier, there are some fake recruitment agencies that ask you to pay money in exchange for a job. Uh, guys, you should never do that because recruitment agency never takes money from the candidate, from the job seeker. They take money only from the company for which they are hiring the candidate. If the company is asking uh, you to pay money, most probably it's a scam or they try to earn money from both parties, but honestly I think it's illegal. So guys, I know how you feel, I know how some of you want to move to Dubai and get a job here, but stay safe, follow my tips, don't lose your money and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye!